Russia is preparing a provocation against Ukraine in Africa. Russia is preparing a provocation against Ukraine allegedly related to the illegal trafficking of Western weapons in Africa. The main intelligence directorate of the Ministry of Defense of Ukraine reported this on its Telegram channel. It is noted that against the backdrop of the weakening positions of Russia and its proxy forces on the African continent, enemy intelligence services are preparing another information special operation directed against Ukraine. In particular, the Kremlin will try to accuse Ukrainian special forces of allegedly using weapons of foreign origin during hostilities in the Republic of Sudan. To do this, Russian propagandists plan to publish in the media, in particular in Libya, ordered publications and fabricated photographs of captured weapons of American origin, previously captured by mercenaries of the so-called Wagner Group during the war in Ukraine, the statement says. It is noted that the purpose of such publications is to discredit Ukraine and its partner as well as to accuse Western allies of uncontrolled arms trafficking with the participation of Ukraine. The Kremlin will also try to emphasize that elite Ukrainian special forces are participating in combat operations in Africa at a time when Russia is waging a genocidal war in Ukraine itself. The main intelligence directorate of the Ministry of Defense noted, at the same time, it is added that in connection with religious holidays that continue in the Muslim world, including some African countries, Russian intelligence services were forced to fabricate the necessary photographic materials on the territory of Belarus. We emphasize that Ukraine and its defense forces continue to act exclusively within the framework of international law and the UN Charter with respect for the sovereignty of all countries and have nothing to do with any illegal actions related to illicit arms trafficking, the statement said. Armed police have been deployed in the center of Paris following reports of a threat to the Iranian consulate. A police source told Reuters the man was seen entering the consulate, carrying what appeared to be a grenade and explosive vest. French police cordoned off the Iranian consulate in Paris where a man is threatening to blow himself up, French radio station Europe One reported. Service was interrupted on a nearby metro line for security reasons, the RATP Metro Company said neighboring streets in the city's 16th district in the center was cordoned off. The area around the consulate, which is close to Trocadero and the River Seine, is popular with tourists and the Paris Metro was suspended in the nearby area, transport officials said IT was unclear whether the incident had any link to the escalating tensions between Iran and Israel. On April 19, Explosions echoed over the Iranian city of Isfahan in what sources described as an Israeli attack, but Tehran played down the incident and indicated it had no plans for retaliation, a response that appeared gauged towards averting region-wide war recall with the Paris Olympic Games 100 days away. Police carried out a large-scale eviction at France's biggest squat in the south of the country's capital. Authorities, including dozens of gendarmes, cleared out the makeshift camp at an abandoned bus company headquarters in vitry sur -Seine. The camp had become home to about 450 migrants, with images of the eviction spreading rapidly across social media.